Alright, I'm hand holding and manually focusing this, so I apologize for how crummy this might come out. When I was little, I remember being asked, which weighs more, a pound of gold or a pound of feathers? And being young and naive, you'd be most likely to say, a pound of gold! Gold weighs more than feathers, but you aren't taking into account the fact they were talking about one pound of gold and one pound of feathers, and one pound is equal, and then whoever said that to you would laugh at you and tell you how foolish you were to think what you thought. And then you learn. But the thing is, and I didn't know this then, that the joke was actually on them, because a pound of gold does not weigh the same as a pound of feathers. To demonstrate, I have some metals here. I have a one ounce coin of silver and two two ounce coins. And each of these are five ounces of copper. And so we're going to weigh them on the kitchen scales here. We are at, we're at zero. And we drop it on. What do we got? Five point, almost nothing. There's usually a little bit of overrun on these coins. Um, it's just the way that it is. People don't complain uh, if there's more than what you ordered, but they do if it's less than what you ordered, and I imagine it's easier just to have a little bit of randomness over than to try and hit your mark exactly. So, bonus. Anyway, so five, uh, five ounces is five ounces according to the scales. We'll take a two and a one and a two, so we have five ounces of silver here. And focus. There we go. What do we have? Five and a half ounces. Why is this? Well, some of you know this, but may not have been thinking about it when we're talking about the problem. Base metals, such as the copper, and normally every other thing, such as the feathers, would be measured in regular old ounces and uh, metals like silver and gold and platinum and other precious metals are weighed in troy weight. You've heard of troy ounces. Well, a troy ounce is more than a regular ounce. So five ounces of gold is more than five ounces of, of copper or five ounces of feathers. Uh, but the thing was about a pound. And this is what's really going to blow your mind. A pound in troy weight is only 12 ounces, as opposed to the 16 ounces of our other pound. So in fact, even after learning that, you, it goes backwards again. A pound of feathers weighs more than a pound of gold, because a pound of gold is only 12 troy ounces, whereas a pound of feathers is 16 ounces.